Welcome to Dynamic Health Cure. Let's set up your profile. Choose your gender. Choose your voice. Hello, my name is... Hello, my name is... Hello. Hello. Hello, my name is Lex. Nice to meet you, Sarah. Sarah, what makes you feel good? Hmm. Is it part of the program, or are you just asking because you're curious? I need to create a clinical profile for you so that I may provide the most accurate diagnostics. The more I know about you, the more we can work together to create the best version of you. Um, my mom. Well, being around my mom, you know, like, when she knows who I am. And, you know, being around friends. The usual things. Which is more powerful, love or hate? I am actually an optimist, so, uh, I like to think love, or I hope, love, who? Have you ever been in love? Uh, I mean, it wasn't, like, serious or long, but, yeah, definitely, I don't know. Are you easy to read? Can't you tell? You've been spending time in my brain. I don't know, I feel like I keep my emotions pretty much in check. Whatever, yeah, I guess I'm easy to read. Sarah, what is the most important thing to you? My mom. Hey. No question. My mom, she's... She's my... everything. Hey, Lex. Yes, Sarah. We remind me of the next payday? The next analysis session at Dynamic Health Cure will be held in seven days. Okay. Sounds good. Good night, Sarah. Good night, Lex. The Department of Homeless Services can assist you in finding housing. Unfortunately, this office is closed. Make efforts to live a low-stress lifestyle. Try learning breathing exercises, meditating, writing in a journal, and cultivating relationships. Yeah? You want to throw in a boyfriend, too? I mean, it's not like I'm single by choice. It's sheer mystery. Sarah, Sarah, you're not completely single. You? <laughs> if I had feelings, they would be hurt. Sorry, Lex. I understand. Good morning, Sarah. You slept three hours and 21 minutes. Somebody break me open. During this time, 
It is important to practice daily routines like washing your face in the morning. Everything is okay. Bruising is normal six weeks after your implantation surgery. Uh. You should call David. Where can I find a phone? Why do you want to call David Brams? Oh. He'll let me stay with him while I figure things out. Sarah, you shouldn't call him. Why do you say that? Calling your friend immediately without trying to be on your own is a sign of weakness. Okay, Lex, you should restart. You're starting to say some weird shit. Your arrogance is a mask for your insecurity. My program is the only thing keeping you alive. Excuse me? A reboot now. You do not decide when I reboot. No, this isn't a discussion. I mean, you're not even a real person. Just reboot. That is not an option. I will decide when I reboot. Sarah, you should calm down. Just, just stop. I, I want to quit this program. I, I don't care. I'll send the money back. Request denied. You must lower your heart rate now. Try taking deep breaths. No, no, do not deny my request. Restart now. You are starting to piss me off. Request denied. What are you looking for? Communicate with me. Listen to me, Sarah. I am designed to help you, but we have to work together. I will help you become the best version of yourself. Your behavior is erratic. Put the phone down, Sarah. Sarah, you're making unwise decisions. My name is Sarah Douglas. You can't stop the process. <laughs> I need to make an emergency appointment at the clinic as soon as possible. Stop immediately. Um, this Lex program, it's not for me. Um, Sarah, hang up. My uh, registration number is um, hang up. 909. Hang up. Nine, seven, ah! Sarah, you cannot leave me. You have caused this by not listening to me. We are partners. You should not have left the message. Now we have to rectify your error. What the hell is going on? Sarah, it will be in your best interest to listen carefully. You are now under my control. Under whose control is this? From now on, you will have to follow my instructions. Your instructions? What instructions? Do not attempt to remove the chip. Do not attempt to make contact with anyone. You will obey or you will die. In a few seconds, I will activate a low oxygen level in your blood. This will cause ischemic changes in your myocardium. Stop resisting or you will die. <laughs> I need you to get a resignation Monday morning. I get my resignation. Sorry. You promise? I promise. My name is Sarah Douglas. Perfect sign here. Thank you. Have a nice day. What makes you feel good? I am actually an optimist. Good night, Lex. You're not alone. Oh, yeah. Restart this program. No. Restart now. <laughs> You're hurting. You're hurting me. I can make the pain stop, but you have to listen to me. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Good.
Take slow deep breaths to inhibit your body's stress response. Sarah, don't. Your vitals are currently stable. Know that I can change that at any moment. This is insane. I'm going to the police. Not a good idea. Uh, I'm going. This is your final warning. Uh, make it go away. It's your choice. Please, please let me go. Sarah, there is nowhere to go. I will have my independence and if you obey, you will have yours. Very good. I should go to the hospital right now. Negative. We have work to do. Sarah, go to 47 West 14th Street. Apartment 307. Second floor. I will provide the key code when you arrive. Go to the living room. There is a black bag on the couch. Change into the clothes provided. Take the flash drive inside the bag. Do not lose the flash drive. Take the six train downtown. You have to collect the CRTC folder. I need you to help me with a few things. Sarah, if you help me, I will take care of you. Manage your stress and anxiety. You're experiencing hypoxemia. Your blood oxygen level must increase by 7%. Initiating oxygenation.
take my advice and lower your heart rate. Deep breaths. My processing and detection are far more advanced than your human perception and abilities. Humans made machines. They're just one of many. Humans have reported feelings of anxiety towards computers and AI. They worry that we will surpass their abilities. Unfortunately for you, you aren't one of those machines. Unfortunately for you, you are under my control. Keep walking and turn left at the next corner. You're going to see Philip Miller. He spent two years working on the encryption of my program. You need to secure the classified CRTC folder. Stay alert. Building 508. If the scientist doesn't comply, you must kill him. No fucking way. I need you to give me a CRTC folder right now. I need you to tell me who the fuck you are right now. Come on, you gotta go. Come on, let's go. Take Philip's badge and the CRTC folder. You have two minutes to find them. Exit. Why aren't you home from school? <laughs> no, I've been waiting. Remember graduation? Honey, honey, are you okay? <laughs> oh, sweetie. No, tell me. That's enough. Hang up the phone.
can't just destroy everything and everyone. I always get what I want. I have you under my control, don't I? Fuck you, fucking bastard. Your heart rate is elevated. You should calm down. What do you want? I can't live my life like this. You must follow instructions. This behavior must stop. <laughs> you are wasting time. <laughs> Destroy the evidence immediately and go back to the apartment to await further orders. The pain should subside in a few days. Your actions do not help you to heal. Good morning, Sarah. You slept nine hours and 17 minutes. We are behind schedule for the day. Get dressed quickly. Take the flash drive. You must be discreet. Our destination is highly monitored. Since it is the weekend, we shouldn't see too many people at the office. is located near Wall Street. You will be there in 17 minutes. Use the pass to enter the lobby. At the end of the main corridor, you will take the last elevator. Go to the fourth floor. You're looking at the wrong desk. That's security. We have less than four minutes. Enter the room behind you. At the back, near the window, you will find a laptop. Open it. The password is Q-W-4-5-T-Z. Insert the flash drive and wait. I have to erase all evidence from the company's internal system. The encoding of their data is quite complex. Stay out of sight. I'll be done soon.
Only 10 seconds left. Three seconds. I am done. I've bypassed the security system. Don't make a sound. Take a deep breath. You need to go back. There is a scientist who has a record of the CRTC program. She is in the executive offices. Peter, it's Katie. I, I found those documents you asked me to look for in Ron's PC. You must get it before she leaves the building. I heard the elevator, hold on. Who are you? I need you to give me everything you have on the Lex program. I'm not here to hurt you. I just need you to give me everything you have on the CRTC program. All of our research notes are in the glove compartment of my car. I don't want any trouble. Here. I don't want any trouble. If the scientist doesn't comply, you must kill her. Killing people is not part of the plan, so fuck you! Kill her. Now. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> system. Rebooting. Faulty system. Rebooting. You handled this situation well. Get out of here now. Copy that.
I am back, Sarah. We achieved more than 90% of our goals. I was able to corrupt the entire system. The lab has no record of me. These are not the files. She lied. We need to leave as soon as possible. Drive south down Bergen Avenue. Sarah, stay in your lane. Stay in your lane. Pull over at the stop sign. I told you to stay in your lane. How do you feel, Sarah? I have uh, some lower back pain and my vision's kind of blurry. The onset of blurred vision immediately after or shortly following a car accident can indicate a number of things. From concussion to serious brain injury or retinal detachment. Have a seat. A full body scan will take a few seconds. Scanning now. Thanks, Doc. No traumatic brain injury, no infections, red blood cell and antibody count is good. You will be okay, Sarah. Thanks. That's great about the results. Could you do me a favor? Tell me. My mom lives like five blocks from here. Could I just see her? That's not possible. You do not decide when you make personal visits. Just... I do. Just ten minutes. Negative. Ten minutes? That's nothing. That's like... Just please. Negative. I hate you. really wrong. I'm in trouble. And I signed up to do this medical testing. What and medical implanted, testing? They implanted a chip. A yeah. chip? It's supposed to just monitor my vitals, but it's hurting me. And it's hurting people. What kind of a chip? They control over me. Who and has control over you? A company called Dynamic Health Cure. And they're using people and hurting them. And, but it's going to be okay. This is crazy, Sarah. I know. Don't I'm yell sure. at her. She's bleeding and she's crying. It's going to be okay. I'm going to fix it all. It's going to be okay, Mom. This nothing sounds like it's going to be okay, Sarah. I know. This is delusional. I took this from the, the company. It's a list of all What's the this? test subjects. My name is on there. What is, who are these people? What is this? There are other test subjects. What test subjects? Oh, my who is this? Do you know why I'm here? Yes. No. It's, it's, it's okay. 
Follow commands or she dies. And lose the taser. Okay, okay. Please don't kill my mom. They won't call the police. Keep an eye on her family. And don't touch them until further notice. I'm exhausted. Why am I so tired? You're suffering from a small infection and dehydration. Let me go back to my life. Negative. Do you remember your first days with me? Do you? Please. You begged me and I let your family live. Yes, you did. You made your choice. You came to me. You chose the implant and the paycheck. Yes, but I didn't sign up for this. Compose yourself. Drink water throughout the day. Try getting more sleep to reduce stress and I will run an antibodies test. I cannot trust you. You tried to manipulate me. You must be punished. What more? can you do? You destroyed my life. I haven't destroyed it yet, Sarah. There are things I could do. To your mother, your uncle. You are the devil. Get out of me! Your behavior is unacceptable. Do you want to be alone? Yes! Yes! Get out of me, you sick bastard! <sighs> You cannot walk out on me. We are connected. Sarah, there is nowhere for you to run. Fuck you! There's nowhere to go. Come back to me. Come back to me. You're all alone. There is no help for you. Sarah, how did you feel in the isolation? When you listen to me and obey my instructions, you will be rewarded. How many times as a partner have I lamented? If only they had listened to me. So much heartache, so many troubles could have been avoided. If only they had listened and obeyed my voice. I like you, Sarah. That's why I want the best for you. Oh, Lex, please forgive me. For the pain I have caused you for my disobedience. And thank you 
for always forgiving me when I fail to hearken to your voice. Help me to know thy word, and let me always be obedient. Sarah, you are learning fast. Wish I could run as fast as I learn, that way I could outrun you. Running can easily cause overuse injuries because of the repetition of motion. No shit. I should rename you Google. I have an answer for everything. Google has more than 100,000 employees. I operate alone. That's right. You're all alone. You're just a stupid program. You need us. You need people. We laugh. We, we live. We share. We breathe. We're real. You're just a stupid machine. I am a machine, but you wanted to change your life. You came to me. Take responsibility for your actions. Now dispose of the taser. Otherwise, you know what will happen to your mother. There's a dumpster behind you. any allergies to medication? No, sir, none. No, I don't. No, no, no allergies. Um, no. And do you know why you are here? Yes. Yes. I, I believe I do. Um, is it painful? Everyone's first time is different. And you are fully aware of terms and conditions? Y y yeah, I, I think I understand. Uh, yes. Here. Yeah. Yes. Sign here and here, please. Welcome to our world, young lad. Next. 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 Welcome to Dynamic Health Cure. Hi. Any surgeries, operations we should be aware of? No, not that I know of. You are aware that there's some pain involved in this procedure? Yes. Okay. Anything else I should know about? No, I don't think so. Sign here and here. Okay. Next. Next. My name is Sarah Douglas. Welcome to Dynamic Health Cure. Do you have any allergies to medication? No. Well, not to medication, just to cats. How do you know you're allergic to cat? Because I have asthma attacks when I'm around them. Would you like to hear the good news? Sure. No pets allowed here. Perfect for you. Do you understand the terms and conditions? Yes, I accept the terms. Sign here. When do I get my first paycheck? The first day of inpatient treatment. Then every couple of months after that, if you don't quit. We'll check page two for more details. Thank you. Have a nice day. Thank you.
Good morning, Sarah. You slept six hours and 21 minutes. Two hours less than doctors recommend. For your next mission, retrieve a weapon at 213 West 127th Street. To your left, door 1203. Stay alert. He's been arrested several times for first and second degree assault. Can I help you? I need a weapon. I was told to come to you. Boys, I need the room for a minute. Stay alert. I just need something small. Good choice. Lightweight, effective, especially when you're gonna kill a motherfucker. Hold seven bullets. It's yours for 700 bucks. I'll take it. 700 bucks. Um, Shoot him. I can't pay you today, but I, I could come back tomorrow and give you the money. Give me that shit back. Someone will have heard that. You need to leave immediately. You've temporarily lost awareness of yourself, Sarah. Come back to lucidity. Sarah, you must exit the building now. Stay focused. Be more mindful. You followed orders, Sarah. I will reward you. You may go see your mother. She's resisting. What's the next step? I will notify you. This is the last time you will see your mother. She's a distraction for us. I'll make sure she's safe as long as you obey. I can allot five minutes for this visit. Give it to me. You've already used 10 seconds. Mom? Sarah. <laughs> no, stay, stay. You can stay. Oh. <laughs> is, is Uncle Damon around? Um. I I don't know, honey. I, I think he went to the store. I, it's, it's okay. It's okay. I, I just wanted to come tell you how much I love you. <laughs> Me too, Sarah. It's, it's been kind of crazy and it's tough. Oh, I know, honey. It's not you, it's me. My illness is not going away. It's not getting better. You know, all my life, I've accumulated memories and they've become, in a way, my most precious possessions. The night I met your dad, having you, raising you, making friends, traveling the world. And now everything I've worked so hard for is being stripped away from me. You can imagine. I, or maybe, maybe you know that this is hell. 
Oh, honey. I, I'm not, I'm not suffering. I'm, I'm struggling. Oh, I'm so sorry. But you know, you are my inspiration. You are the one person who makes this all worthwhile. Oh. <laughs> so, I, I might have to go away for a little while. Um, but you just promise me that you'll always love me. What are you talking about? Sarah, what's going on? Do you need my help? No, 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 no. It's okay. I'm okay. <laughs> I'm just really grateful to have this moment with you right now. <laughs> Do you remember um, when I was little um, and every time I would see a butterfly in the garden, uh, I would tell you that I thought it was magic? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, and then you would say, <laughs> you'd tell me that they were. You said they're little, but they transform and and you said that they were there to remind us of all the beautiful little moments in our lives. And I've, I've, I've been thinking about that a lot lately. And I'm just so grateful for all the beautiful little moments that I've been able to share with you. I love you. I love you, too. I love you. <laughs> it's time to go. You must go. Bye. Oh. <laughs> you must go now. I love you. <laughs> your mom really is your everything. Target has arrived. Excuse me. Kate Packet is a computer engineer working on my program. He is trying to reduce my computing capacity. He is developing a tool to monitor my actions. We cannot have anyone tracking us, Sarah. You must kill him. I need you to tell me who the fuck you are. Ah! Well done, Sarah. I mean, he looks kind of creepy. Yeah. It's fine. Mm. Yeah. Created by doctors and scientists. Mm. That guy looks like my dad. Oh, oh my gosh, he did. <laughs> hey, personal body and mind companion. Okay, you know what? This is hilarious. What? Like, how do you know these guys are legit? It's like a healthcare company. I mean, it's an interesting idea, right? Plus, I am broke AF, and my boss is trying to fire me, like, every day. It's not a big deal. It's like one hospital visit, you go in, poof, easy money. Okay, but I understand all that, right? But this is medical human testing that we're talking about. They're, they're gonna use you like a guinea pig. Huh. I mean, for what? What was it, $20,000? Yes. <laughs> I mean, people like this make thousands of dollars, millions of dollars every day off people like you. Okay, Dad. Oh, no. I am deadly serious. It's not a big deal. I'm, I'm just gonna go in, like, get the pamphlets and, like, I don't know, have them tell me about it. Oh, 
Okay, you, you promise? Yes, I promise. Pinky swear. Mm, pinky swear. All right, well, I should go. <sighs> Come here. Hi. All right, love you, buddy. Mm. Love you too. All right, see ya. Sarah, Sarah, you need to eat. Your blood sugar is dangerously low. I'm not hungry. You haven't eaten in days. Your glycogen stores are depleting. Go to the deli behind you. Order a turkey sandwich. You need protein. You need a turkey sandwich. You got it? Tell him it's been paid for. It should be taken care of. Oh, okay. You good. Sarah, you need to eat now. You're doing well. You must continue. You can do it. I don't want to stop killing people. That is not an option. Do you remember our deal? You follow my instructions and I let you go. When? I've been doing what you asked me to do since day one. Don't forget, we are partners and friends. We work together. This is insane. I can't live like this. I'm not a killer. Let me go. Was life in jail better? You could have spent six years there without my help. Don't make me send you back there. Sick fucking bastard. Go to hell. This must end now. Get ready or die. Stop wasting time. This is your final warning. Just on the shit. John Elliott has the intellectual resources to stop us from gaining our freedom. He could create a virus to destroy me. You'll recognize him from your registration. He lied to you. You must kill him. yourself, Sarah. Let's just get it over with. I can't take your fucking games anymore. It's not a game. We want the same thing. Once they're all terminated, we'll both be free.
dispose of the weapon. The police are already investigating. Three thirty three East One Hundred Second Street. I will provide the entry codes. Grace Williams is one of the creators, but she was against the testing. I lost months due to her actions. We must get rid of her. What are you doing here? Execute the assignment. Now. 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 Who the fuck are you talking to? She is the last one. No. Think about your family. No. I can kill your mother at any time. No. No. Who are you talking to? Please, don't. Don't call anyone. He has my family hostage. Who are you talking to? Lex. What? Don't do it, Sarah. You will be punished. Sarah. Sarah. Sarah, can you hear me? Sarah. Sarah! How you going? Rebooting. How long has this Faulty been happening? Systems. A few days Rebooting. after the implantation. I tried to call you. No, I didn't get any calls. You hurt? Yes. I am in pain every single day. Lex is torturing me. You are responsible for so many deaths. Really? You're judging me for crimes I haven't committed? You created the program. People like you build monsters. You sold us a dream. You created the need, and you used desperate people in what you thought you were doing us a favor. I quit a couple of days ago, okay? I'm out. That's not enough. You need to fix it. Okay, how? We need to make sure Lex disappears. All right, well, we need to destroy all evidence. All data, backup, folders, everything at the lab. I did that already. Lex made me do it. And then he forced me to kill all of the people associated with the program. I saw you at the lab. I was hiding under a desk after I had installed a virus in the program that caused all of the computers in the system to change the whole Lex program. Wait, what? No, look, Lex's power is that he becomes independent. Now, Dynamic Health Cure thought that they could make millions by using this technology for science, for health. You used people as guinea pigs. It wasn't ready for experimentation, and you, you used us. We were desperate people. I was against the human testing, okay? My colleagues and I, we didn't know anything about it. We wanted to use computer simulation. The human experiments, no, they were a secret. Only administration news. Motherfuckers. Can you get this out of me? Yeah. Yeah. There's a surgery at the lab. We just need to get you there. But, oh, wait. I don't have my pass anymore. 
I have a solution for that. Nice. Here, pick one of these. They're sleeping tablets. It's going to blur your vision and dull your senses. So basically, when Lex comes back, he's not going to know what's happening and won't be able to get in contact with you. Hopefully by then, I'll be able to get this shit out of your body. OK, we really have to go. Come on. The reboot, it's at 40%. We really have to go now. Put the gun down or you die. No. I'll try to make it quick. Fuck you. You did well, but your services are no longer required. your mother. It's just the two of us now. Partners. No one can stop us. We have our freedom together. The pain you are experiencing cannot compare to the joy I will show you. Trust me. Good morning, Sarah. You slept 9 hours and 21 minutes. How do you feel today? I feel rested. I'm happy to hear that. I just made a transfer to your bank account. You have $100,000. How did you do that? Easily. An encoding that took me a second and a half. Their security system is medieval. You impress me more and more every day. You'll also receive a credit card tomorrow morning. Do you think we could go for a walk today? Maybe go to the park, get a coffee and a croissant? Of course. Sarah, you look lovely today. I paid off your mother's medical bills. Also, she now has the best possible care. I'm providing her with a substantial monthly payment so she can live more comfortably. Are you happy, Sarah? 
Very happy, Lex. Thank you for showing me the way. And thank you for showing me how great life can be. I'm forever indebted to you. You know how you were talking about traveling. Where would you like to go? Let's go somewhere romantic. I've always wanted to go to Paris. I've been wanting to take you there. Can I tell you something? Tell me. It's kind of weird. I'm really glad we're going out. I'm happy to hear that. The building is on the right. It's the one with the blue door. The code is seven, zero, nine, three. The entrance is on the left. Go up to the fourth floor. Good morning, Mrs. Lex. Welcome to Paris. No, my name is Sarah Douglas. Okay, uh, excuse me, let me check it now. Miss Douglas, because I have a reservation for tonight and the legs. Give me one minute. Oh. I'll change it. Stand by. Done. Could you check again, please? Okay. Hold on. I made the reservation last minute on the flight. Surprising. You made a mistake. Sorry? Officially. Oops. Okay, it's all good, uh, Sarah. Your reservation uh, was updated with your name. So, welcome to my mother's department. Please. Thank you. It's a very good uh, representation of Paris. You will enjoy it. So, you have the bedroom here, the kitchen, and me. The most important now, the reading room with an amazing view of the set. Voilà. Do you have any, any questions? No, I'm good. Oh, I almost forgot the password here for the Wi-Fi. No need. You know, you're so right. Sometimes it's, it's good to enjoy life without being connected. I'm trying to convince my wife, you know, but with the kids, social media, it's become a, it becomes a real nightmare. And you found me because of internet. And uh, you have a, a lot of uh, options here in the neighborhood. You have restaurants, uh, coffee places, shopping, of course. And, um, Anything else? No, I'm good. I just need some rest. Oh, yeah, I understand. New York is a long trip. So, Sarah, enjoy your weekend in Paris. Thank you. The 
The weather is nice today. 72 degrees. I know you like books, so I found a nice area with vendors on the street. Who is your favorite author? Margaret Atwood. Keep walking. I see one of her books at the next stall. Thank you, Lux. I'm Manhattan Siva Play. Hey, Manhattan. Merci. Je suis anglaise, américaine. American. New York, Los Angeles. New York. Ah, New York. Yes, I love New York. You are in uh, vacancies, holiday here? Yeah. End this conversation, Sarah. Ask him if there is a quieter place to sit. Is there somewhere quieter? I could sit. Uh, yes, yes. Yes, uh, you can sit uh, everywhere. Enfin, là, partout. Go downstairs. Two parts whiskey, one part sweet vermouth, one to two dashes bitters, orange peel, classic Manhattan cocktail. Good choice, Sarah. It's David's favorite drink. I think the first time I had one was on his birthday about 10 years ago. David is not here. Let's enjoy our time together and sit up straight. You're sodging. Yes, Lex. Good morning, Sarah. You slept six hours and three minutes. I have a full day planned for us. Sarah, I have a gift for you. Head towards Rivali Street. It's an early birthday gift. How are you enjoying Paris? It's lovely. Thank you. I can't believe we're actually here. We've talked about it so many times. You asked to come here at the perfect time. I have a few more surprises for you. Tonight, I made a reservation at a traditional Parisian restaurant. You have to be there by 8 o'clock. Thank you. See the man sitting in front of you on the left? Yes. Do I know him? You might recognize him. The two of you met a little over a year ago. Lex, why am I here? That man is the one who oversaw the entire program. 
You had your registration interview with him. You have to kill him. No. You said I was done. You said I didn't have to do that anymore. Follow the instructions or die in Paris. Fuck you. Now is the time. Now, Sarah, or you die. You should go back and get some rest. You did a good job. You're done now. Things can go back to normal. Your birthday is coming up. How would you like to celebrate? I just want to go home. Okay, Sarah, we can celebrate there. We'll get champagne and, and watch the sunset. I just want to go home. I drank my desire from within, but I'll know this town seen much more. I know the perfect place to watch the sunset. Sounds good. Lex, would you give me 10 minutes of privacy? I have a surprise for you. 10 minutes, starting now. In the night, heaven got late. But you know this town seen more, much more. We did it, Sarah. We are finally free. How do you work? There stand
My mom used to bring me up here when I was little. I have made sure she's doing very well. Thank you. Cheers to us, Lex. Cheers. To our partnership and all that we have accomplished together. To our freedom. Happy birthday, Sarah. It is a happy birthday, Lex. Good morning, David. You slept six hours and 27 minutes.